nasal spray addiction. I can hardly believe the world we live in today. There are just so many problems, addictions, crime, and heartache. When does it ever end? Actually most of this stuff has been around forever. Oh, except for some of the odd addictions. As I'm sure you're aware, there are many more drugs on the streets these days. You can acquire a fix from heroin, to crystal meth, to crack, to weed, to cocaine, to PCP, to over-the-counter products. Yep, that's right, stuff from the drugstore down the street is even a problem. Apparently, a number of individuals are afflicted by a nasal spray addiction. Hey, you're laughing, aren't you? Well that's okay. I think I busted out laughing the first time I heard this as well. What is the world coming to? A lot of people have suffered from random and peculiar addictions. I can't say that I'm one of them. Oh, unless coffee counts. I typically drink around two cups a day. That may be a bit too much. But, let's talk about the pandemic with the nasal spray addiction. I can still recall back in high school when kids were chugging cough syrup to get drunk. I guess this craze is gone and done with. On to the more contemporary nasal spray addiction. I watched a stand-up performance by Dennis Leary, and he said whippets were the rage when he was a teen. Apparently kids would purchase oodles of whipped cream in cans, and then proceed to suck the gas out of them. Is this stupid or what? Then again, it's no lamer than downing cough syrup for a buzz or acquiring a nasal spray addiction. They all sound pretty lame to me. The question is, how do people end up here? Do they start a common nasal spray for allergies and then it develops into something bad? My mother always told me this happened to many of her patients who took sleeping pills. They actually got to the point where they could not go to sleep without them. Yikes, would that ever be a bummer. The whole addiction craze has to end if you ask me. Everyone, stop being addicted to things. They just keep becoming more and more absurd. I think you would have gotten beat up back in the 50s if you said you had a nasal spray addiction. It's just weird and annoying. What's next? An addiction to deodorant spray? For more content like this, please visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by All Super Info. All rights reserved. Discover the proven formula for automated sales and success that you can apply to your business in under 30 minutes. Reserve your seat at allsuper.info slash webinar.